Everyone ready to start? Everyone, can you um just ready up? Yeah, yeah we're ready. Yeah. Need the power one. One more. Radio. Just waiting for Meeks. Fucking play Blackbeard on us. C can someone ban Blackbeard so I don't have to cast Blackbeard, please? I'm actually, I'm actually fucked if you do that. Yeah, it's the only way Monster, yeah, monster can get kills by playing Blackbeard. I've got 1.3 KD on Blackbeard and a point nine on Ash. Point nine on Zoffie. Please don't. I'm still waiting for one person to ready up, and then I'll start. I that I was on 120 ping that whole game. I couldn't do nothing. Okay, everyone's ready. Good luck, guys. Yeah, we're ready. Yeah. Good luck, everyone. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. So we see um, Pluto versus Triad, week one of the European Championship. Hello to the old um, one viewer watching the stream. Oh, two viewers and one comment. So, um, I've got to keep the stream up on my phone, I'm guessing. Uh, standard Thatcher Band coming in. Always good to see. <clears throat> Gotta see the second at attacking ban here. From Pluto. Uh, comments not coming up, so if you did put a comment, try and put it again. And there's the black beard ban, what I asked for. Thank you. Love to see the black beard ban coming out from here from Pluto. Means monster's not going to get any kills, but it is how it is. I meant Pluto monster, not the whole of Pluto. If you're a bit confused, and we see a cave ban. Come in here from Pluto. I'd expect to see a Goyo ban here from Triad, but not sure what we're gonna see here. Gonna see a Valkyrie ban. She's very strong on this map with all the um, pre-play C4s you can do on this map. Like to see how they um, utilize the less intel on the board here. I want more viewers. I'm going to put this in chat because why not? See a castle, a bandit, or a my Jaeger. Bandit Elite, not sure if that's allowed, but um, I'll let it slide. Oh, I'll. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we gonna see any six picks here. Um, I don't think we're seeing any shields being brought here. Oh, we do see the mirror brung out instead of the mute. Not very sure about this, but um, see how it plays out for Pluto. I'm going to put the link in the chat. And I've been warned because I tried to put link in chat. New mug. Okay, thank you. I just had to call um, Pluto Monster a mug. Okay, let's let's see how Pluto Monster doing. It it looks like they're going for an office holder. Fucking old game. Right here. That's the party made. Sorry for that delay. 
we're gonna see an off <clears throat> an office defense here not a very good site to go through first in my opinion but let's see what they do here yeah straight to roof take the hatches not very smart with the mirror in play but like to see our triads go and push this on the Jaegers not roaming at the moment I think they're going for a um, hole upstairs hold in um, office in, in initiation <clears throat> okay we see the jackal already dropped into control room he's taken out the cam we're not going to see anyone holding below. I don't know um, what Yoke is doing. The Marek's already in. No contestion here on initiation from Pluto. I see Meeks on his drone. We're going to see, um, I think it's Kexiv. Drawing out or below from RK. He's going to dr try and get his drone through the thing through the hole in the barricade it's not gonna work so he comes off his drone is he gonna go straight in without checking the drone he checks the drone and the drone is able to get through Martel in a gunfight they've given them initiation control I would say go for a plant here but no one's they're really looking for kills on Marcel good droning in here oh it's a bunk daycare not initiation hold I'm sorry on that wrong call but um they were trying to hold offices and initiation, but nothing's working here. Cafe, it doesn't look like a cafe push, what you normally see for this um, site push. Wait, let me just change something here. We're going to go to party audio so I can actually hear myself think here. And we're going to see um, Pluto going to cafe. Pretty smart move from here. They have gotten um, Daycare open. A good kill from Quinner's YouTube. Or oh, a long angle hold here from Mystery. <clears throat> good shots here from Mystery. And he gets the kill onto the Maverick. Now going into a 4v3 situation here. <clears throat> We're going to see... Um, Fermite going to drone site and Yoki gives him the good night. And are they going to go for a plant? They have 10 seconds left to go. We're going to see the 15 second meta coming here. Keshev gets a kill. Yoki's down. It's, mon it's monster in a 1v3 situation. The plant has gone down. Goes for the wall bang. He's given away his position. We do see <clears throat> the Zofia holding the angle. And attackers take one the first round on theme park. That is a heavy heavy defensive sided map it's not looking good for Pluto here but hopefully we see a very very quick turnaround here from Pluto ok we're going to see Exim looking like he is the hard support player here from Triad on the Thermite we're going to see the Rook Rook Elite we're going to see a lion brought here from um, Triad. I think they're going for the same hold. Bringing the mirror again. The mirror may be baited here from Pluto Monster though. I'm not sure what they're really going to be trying here. They are going for an armory throne hold. So yeah. The buck. <clears throat> not very sure about the buck pick. I would have said lion would have been better. Just for that um, denial on the refrag. But... Not sure if he's going to stick the buck. They're having a good little chat over it. So. He's going to keep the buck. Just not. Just not going to confirm it here. A bit of waste of everyone's time. If you ask me. But. Um, going to see how this runs out here for Triad. Maybe go for the same push. Maybe go for a cafe take. I'm not sure what they're trying to do. But. It'd be. I would say it's likely here to see some rotations, maybe into um, maybe into um, oh, fuck me, I can't speak today. Maybe into blue, into barrel, as some people call it. There's gonna have no rotations. Pretty default setup here, being placed down by Pluto. Maybe they're just going for the default. Said I, these strats are not working. Let's just fuck it off and go onto default strats. So. 
I think that's what they're going to do. Okay. Let's see what the attacker's going. It does look like they're going to go for a cafe tape. Pretty standard here for a cafe tape. We're going to see the lowest ranked player on the Ash. What is um very interesting. Everyone says um Silvers have the best name in the community. Because they're um, brain dead. But um, <clears throat> I'm not sure how it's going to go here. We're going to see three people on their drones. Drones here. Um, the default cams have been taken out. So they won't know the Mavericks sitting open. Sitting in the open. We're going to see five on site. Again from here from Pluto. Not, this could um, be good for them. <clears throat> but they do have the Jackal. So they don't really need to have that drone present. As we've been seeing from most teams in this league. Triad are looking good. This is a very quick roam clear. No one's on their drones. If there was someone roaming here. They could have got one or two free picks here. But again. Yeah they're going to get that top floor. They are going to get that top floor control. Well the planet may get an easy kill here. And he does. Pluto Jamie with the kill onto the buck. That's all their top floor presence basically gone. But I think that's... No, they've still got one C4 in their pocket and two impacts. The impacts may come in for the impact trip. But I don't see any of the walls opened at the top. So I'm not sure if they're going to, going to be trying that impact trick onto the thermite charges. Seeing if they only have one hard breacher. <clears throat> unless the Maverick wants the Maverick trick this. <clears throat> Gotta see one minute... 12 on the clock we're going to see the maverick trying to maverick trick it is going to be heavily contested by the jaeger who puts the thermite basically on one hp it's going to get the far right side of the war open very debatable it gives pluto a lot of cover in sight it still is a 5v1 pluto have not been touched at all we're going to see two three back of throne and we're going to see one in Pussy Corner and one playing behind um, <clears throat> behind the straight wall. We're going to see them go for um, Barrel's wall as well. But he, he cannot see the... Um... Yeah, the Jaeger is going to get... But Kishev gets the kill. And Pluto Mystery gets the refrag there. Oh no, that wasn't a refrag. That was a kill onto the Maverick. That means they're going to have to go for a yellow wall take. We're going to have to see everything thrown out here. A TK comes out here from the firm. And the firm is dead. This should be around for Pluto. We're, we're going to see Yoki. Good night. Try and push in. He gets one kill. But the round goes to Pluto. <clears throat> Triad just couldn't do anything here. About the five men on site hold. It's looking... Great bounce back there from Pluto, but... If that's their strongest site, what is the most winnable site on this map, may I say. It has a, pretty much a 70% win rate in Pro League. I'm not sure how this could go <coughs> for the other teams. It does look like this could be the weaker map for Pluto but we're like <coughs> I'm gonna like to see how the Goyo comes into play as I said he should have been banned in prep phase let's see how he works out for Pluto in the infiltration and office initiation and office hold well I thought it was going to be first round but for my surprise it wasn't and we're just gonna have to see how this goes we're gonna see oh the IQ onto the Ying Ying's more of a fragging up than I say an IQ. Oh, wait, we're going to see a Nomad now. Nomad, this could, um, <clears throat> with the Jackal and the Nomad on play, I think this could be <clears throat> something that works in Triad's favour, as they won't need to have so much drone presence in the map. They've just got to take one bit of the map and Nomad it off, and this could be a very winnable round for um, Triad here, if they play it right. We're still going to see the double hard breach being played here from Triad. Let's see, Pluto. Let's, where did he put his first shield? Uh, he's put it on the doorway in the initiation. Smoke looks like he's going to be playing in between initiation and 
offices. Okay, these shields placements, very, very standard, it looks like. It doesn't look like they have any strats coming into this. It just looks like they're going default, put shields down, let's do this. They, they, they're having no rotations. They're trying to destroy all the wall, so the Thermite can't use, use the other wall to be able to get <coughs> the um, initiation wall that Bandit has just bandited. We are going to see some Rome presence, finally from Pluto. <coughs> Pluto. Okay, let's see what um, Triad are going. They're going for the hatch take again. Wait, no, they are gonna go for a cash push. Already seeing the pro league Ash droning it. It does look like he's gonna go for a quick push in, destroys it. He's gonna go back onto his drone. To see if he can put, he's pushed straight into cash. Could we see some good entries here? He takes out the cam. They know he's there now. They're going to see the wall straight up opened. Great shot from Mystery through the wall. Onto the Nomad. A very, very big pick. Nomad got none of her jabs down. That is going to be a major pick in Pluto's favor. I think we are going to see um, Pluto monster. Yeah, he's going to be sitting in vault. The drones have droned him out. He is going to be playing that extended barrel. I'm not sure if they saw him <coughs> with the mute jammer there. They've definitely seen him now. He's got both the drones. Is he going to maneuver positions? We are going to see Ash into a fight. He is in um, office showers. Going to be on below 50 HP. The Maverick gets a kill onto Monster in Vault. Does that, that's going to mean that they have all of office control and the plant could be put down. But of course that Go Shield is going to come into a very big factor into this round. Wasting time. And here comes out the Toxic Babes. But the plant is already in. I'm not sure if he's seen it. The plant's going down. Four seconds left on the clock. The bandit's going to try and stop it. Marshall gets the flank. Gets one pick. I don't know what the Thermite was thinking. He's on 75 HP. He's now behind it. The C4 comes out. Is this, good? this may be an easy frag. He's below 25 HP. What a drop shot there from the Thermite. He's getting too greedy. Gets popped off. 20 seconds left on the clock. We've got to see a big play here from Monster and Brown. No, Mystery and Brown here. Brown could go for a DFU and then have a cover. He knows he's in off a shower. They need to go for a... Yeah, <clears throat> great frag, great double frag from Yo Yoku, and it is two one to Triad here. Nothing seeming to be going right here <clears throat> from Pluto. They are going to go back to the bunk daycare. Maybe they will have some more presence in initiation and offices that I've seen previously. But we are going to see the Maestro, the Wamai, the Jaeger, the Castle. I would expect to see um, Pluto Mystery on those ar that arcade hallway. But I'm not very sure of what we're going to be seeing here. We are going to see the exact same setup from <coughs> Triad. They are 2-1 up on attack on theme park, so... <clears throat> this, uh, this, this <clears throat> as I was going to say, this is an only best of one. Are we going to see that Ying pick being put in? They are seeming to talk about it here. They are going to see the Nomad, not the Ying. They're still talking about it. We could potentially see a Ying, but he she wouldn't be as effective as the nomad here in my opinion and the nomad is sixth picked i'm not sure why they're sixth picking it for a second time maybe trying to throw off the uh, the defense but i think they will be expecting that sixth pick depending how sh strong <coughs> the nomad has been how strong the nomad can be as well <coughs> we are going to see standard setup here from pluto I'm not sure what they're trying to do with the strats that they're trying, but <clears throat> we are going to see that presence into cash that we saw last round, but I think the more one that I'm concentrated on is that presence into offices, into this room here. I forgot the room name. 
but initiation i would want some pre yeah there is going to be a presence in there that was an easy push for them last time this is a good job from pluto reading the play from that <coughs> from the from the other team it does look like they got oh okay not sure why he shot him once maybe for the tk oh he's burning him now he he is not happy Quinners is not happy paying on 75 is he gonna go for the tk are we gonna see a tk coming out here we're not gonna see a tk but he puts him on 50 hp we're gonna see the gas push probably pushing straight into cash but the mirror is watching it the Jaeger again not roaming, not giving any downstairs present <coughs> presence here from Pluto. The Ash push straight in. Now this is very confusing. Yep. <coughs> the Ash charge goes off. Two Ash charges go off. There's a lot of pressure being put on this mirror and the mirror is already dead. The mirror is already dead in offices. But we are going to see Jaeger try and hold a crossfire onto this Ash. We're going to see the Jaeger run straight across, not ADSing at the door, and that's a double kill from Yoki. Yoku, I mean. Sorry. A double kill there from Yoku. He, he's telling the Thermite to get the wall open, the office wall open, so they can take yellow stairs control. I am not sure where um, the bandit is in this situation. Not sure where he's going to be. We're going to see um, Yoku getting the drone in. Good shots there from the castle, killing off, killing off the Maverick here. We're going to see Pluto. Jamie has that downstairs presence that I've been talking about. I'm not sure if anyone's going to be on flank watch. I haven't seen any air jabs down, gone down, but there is two down apparently. So, going to trust in the game here. They have got a cafe control. They're trying to take arcade control. We we don't see the Wamai putting any presence on arcade. What's a kill from Jamie? Jamie with the double kill. Flanking from yellow. A C4 goes up to yellow. Unsuccessful. But a big double kill there from Jamie. And that is the last air jab gone from the ADS. We're going to see Diffuser top of yellow stairs here. We're going to sit... We're going to see the call out come out onto Brown. Brown's going to try and watch it. He whiffs all of his shot onto the Jackal. The double kill comes out. They are whiffing this round hard. Can Jamie stop the plant? Can he take the planter down? He knows there's going to be one watching. He looks away. He gets the quad kill. And Jamie has won the round for Pluto. He's absolutely loving it. He has loads of time. He has buckets loads of time to get the defu off. What a throw there from Triad. And that puts it at 2-2. Two, two. What a throw from Triad there. Not very sure what they were doing. <clears throat> the Nomad not watching the correct angle for the plant that was going down. The plant was going down. No cover from the Nomad literally lost them that round pluto threw it then we see triad throw the round it <clears throat> it shambles i think we are going to see that lion come out for the refrag we are going to see that lion come out a very smart move here from <clears throat> triad we are going to see a cav i'm not very sure of cav's presence she can be good on this map but i'm i think that's got to be sixth picked because they only have one wall denial. Unless the Rook's going to be 6th pick. Yep. We are going to see the Cav 6th pick. To the Bandit. <clears throat> I would rather see the Rook 6th pick. Because I don't think Rook is a very helpful operator. But it's how um, Pluto want to play this. It is 2-2. We're going to see Yoku. Going to be the real standout player in here i think no there's one other player the captain of triad is the other player that is going positive here 
I'm hoping for a bit of Rome presence here from Pluto. They're just all playing five down anchor strat. What? I'm not very sure about. I haven't seen the armor go down from Pluto Monster. He's upstairs getting hatch. Well, I think the Rook shouldn't be doing in this situation, but again, again, you're going to see it in this kind of play. <clears throat> I am the best caster in this league. Ask anyone. But um, we're going to see the Nomad, the one who cost triad the round in my opinion going up this is a close game one scan already used from quinner's youtube he is gonna going to be pushing straight in playing a very aggressive game here trying to get yellow wall they know there's not going to be any roam presence upstairs as we've seen pluto just not give any shit about roaming here. Nice little pre-fire. He, he loves to show his recoil control. I think he's watching his stream. Lovely recoil control. Uh, yeah, he's definitely watching the stream. I may have to stop the stream for stream sniping. I think you should get out your pistol and shoot at the air. Lion, mate. Are we going to see it? I don't know. He's going to say the guy in the lab. There's going to be a guy in lab. He thinks there's a guy in lab. But I can assure you guys, they are all five on bloody sight. Again. We're going to see the Jaeger on... I don't know what Pluto is doing here. Just give him rounds away from no Rome presence. The Rome presence last round was the main reason that they bloody won last round. And they just don't stick with it. We're going to see the far right of the wall getting taken again. With the lion scan so they don't get flanked. Well executed here from Triad. Getting the wall open. We're going to see one behind straight wall. And one behind a bomb on the box. See two back of throne. Three back of throne. <clears throat> oh. We're going to see Hatch being open up now. Very strange choice I would have said here from um, Triad. The Nomad is down again. Great shot all the way back into the corner here from Quinners. We're going to see them all very low on HP. What is the Thermite doing here? He's going to try and jump on and go for a plant. A C4 could come out here. They've just wasted one of their guys with the C4. The C4 has come out, but it's way too late. Way too late. Okay. <clears throat> the Claymore's gone off. The Injus, it's all going wrong. It's all going wrong here for Pluto. All they need to do is hold Yellow Wall. This is shambles here. He's tried to go out pre-fire. Monster's coming back. Gets killed. Uh, yeah. Flawless round here from Triad. This is bloody shambles from Pluto. I would expect more from this sort of team. But <clears throat> just no presence, no nothing. I'm not seeing anything good here. It's, there's just nothing. Nothing here. What has impressed me one bit. This has not impressed me one bit. I'm sorry, but Pluto have just not been at their game today. <clears throat> That's not saying this hasn't been amazing to watch from Triad, but I just haven't seen the capabilities that I expected from Pluto in this map. 3-2 down on defense. <clears throat> not attack on defense on theme park. We ain't seen anyone hit the 10 mark yet. Normally by this, we see 
like a standout player come out but I've not seen any standout from either team we're gonna see a third viewer come into the stream and this is not looking good for Pluto at the moment <clears throat> put in the comments if you think Pluto can bring this back we're gonna see the Goya come out again I want to see a bit of Rome Pleasance here from Pluto I've just seen absolutely nothing Pluto just looking absolute shambles just nothing here from Pluto to be proud of oh we're going to see a comment the third comment of the stream I'm going to go check this comment and see what this person has said but we are going to see the Ella I think it's Ella shotgun <laughs> Alex welcome to the stream welcome 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 Oh, and we're going to see Nova in the chat as well. Nova, can I just call you a shitter? As I would like to put that, but um, we are going to see Pluto 3-2 down on defense here. Alex has um, predicted a 7-5 score to um, Pluto. Hopefully they can bring this back, but I'm not sure if that's going to happen, guys. We are going to see a bit of Rome Presence finally. I think this is the first time we've seen Rome Presence in this game. They are going to try and flush out <coughs> this Goyo early on. There you go, Jamie. Jamie gets a kill on Quinner's YouTube. We're going to see Buck push into office bathroom. We're going to see the Goyo literally on one HP in office. Still has the Goyo shield to be working from. We're going to see them all in cash at the moment. Big, big kill. And another big kill. They've... Oh, they don't have... There's one sitting in vault with his... On cams. They've droned him out. He has the shotgun out to be able to punish here. He's trying to get... Lovely aim there from the... um from Mr. and we see the flank coming and no refrag from the silver one player Keshev no refrag onto Marcel Marcel's gonna sit at the bottom of throne and just watch I don't I don't know if the Fermite knows that he's gonna be pushed he's been pushed out by Pluto what is that I, I just can't can't fathom this now they've got the fuser in bathroom. No one's got to be. He has the ADS. He has the Goyo shield. Jackal has no intel. He's gonna get shot. Mystery's got to push out. Yeah, he pushes out and gets the kill. It's free, free. To end the split. Lovely here from Pluto. Mystery. If this goes to a draw, then there will be no overtime. <coughs> if you didn't know, but. Not seeing anything. I want to see some better attack here from Pluto. I've just seen nothing to be proud of here. I told them I expected to win this game. And I've just seen nothing good. We are going to see an armory thrown. Hold here. From Triad. We're going to see the Alibi. The Bandit. The Jaeger. The Liege in the castle. I, I, want, I want this alibi to stay to be honest I want the alibi to stay I want to see the alibi in play but it's not going to be in play we are going to see the caviera on the board instead if you can hear me Quinners I'd love to see the alibi in play the alibi will not be put in play oh the alibi will be in play he's listening the alibi in play there you go Let's see how this goes. I, I am hoping for more Rome game here from Triad. I saw none of it in the first six rounds. Oh, we're going to see one AFK player in a Meeks melee. <clears throat> Just going to be here. 
just standing. He, he has nothing to do, so I, I don't blame him. We're going to see Yoku on the Jaeger. A 3-3 split. I think um, Triad will take this as a win. But <clears throat> we're going to see Marcel on the Ash, the Tomb Raider Ash, that I'm not sure is allowed, but we are just going to be seeing this. We are going to see a lot. Uh, oh, we're going to see the spawn peak. Is there? A, there's people spawning there as well. This could be big from Alibi. The Alibi misses all of her shots onto the Thermite. That could have been massive. What a whiff from the Alibi. They didn't even know he was spawn peak. And they're going for the top floor of Rome clear. We are going to see Al Alibi on below 50 HP playing in lab. We're going to see Bandit on his cams. They are joining out all of top floor. We do have the Jaeger playing upstairs. Lovely roam presence here from Yoku. No, Yoku's just going to drop back. Trying to watch officers. Yeah, this roam clear is not looking as efficient. Shots being traded there. The alibi has come up to help Yoku. The roam clear not looking very efficient here from Plur as of yet. Oh, we're going to see Al alibi going for a couple of shots. Take. Taking more shots there. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> My mic unplugged. And we're going to see the Ash be injured. We're going to see him try and trade shots. I think um, he's going to try and get another angle. He does get droned out. We are going to see the revive. That he's going to put Ash on 20 HP. And the alibi is down. A good frag from Pluto Jamie onto Quinner's YouTube. But we are going to see the Jaeger drop off. With a minute left of the round, no wall open. We're just going to see all three defenders on site just on their cams this is very good trying to help out the defender the defender's gotta know that jackal's gonna be in there he does take a couple of bullets he does get the kill onto the ash but and he gets another one onto the jackal oh this is awful and apart from pluto we are gonna see an injure onto monster on nomad what a double kill put there from Yoku. He's going super saiyan right now in this game. He's currently going 10 and 3. Definitely up there for player of the week here, boys. We're going to see them shooting into pussy corner. The C4 comes out, probably destroying the air jab there. Good kill from Meeks onto the Nomad of Monster. Yoku's taken out. Uh, it's just shambles here and the Rome presence wins Triad the round Yoku went bloody over 9,000 with his super saiyan nature in there coming into play Just nothing you can do about it Think you can do about it We are going to see Yoku on the Jaeger. Quinn has gone onto the visual. Very upsetting that we're not going to see another round of Alibi, but we are going to see him. We're going to see the smoke. More of a standard setup here for Bunk Daycare. But it is for free to try it at the moment. <clears throat> we are going to see. Oh, are we going to see an Alibi? We're going to see Twitch. I, I wouldn't advise taking the buck off for the twitch just because of that um top floor presence that we could see but I, i'm not seeing if they're going for that top floor presence or that vertical play from mystery here it there is going to be visual and twitch being brought into play the visual was already on the board but i'm not sure what triad the communication is just not looking there from triad but they're still winning round so just need to see a bit of an improvement from um, Pluto here.
Pluto have just not looked ready for the pressure that <clears throat> Triad have been put on. So, just not sure. They're just doing a standard setup. Yoku um, is turning on his hacks to go Super Saiyan, as we saw him standing still there. He is going off on the roam. Finally, some roam being brought into play. Oh, is he going to go for a spawn peak? They're all going to spawn there again. And we're going to see Marcel taken out early on. The Zofia is dead. Oh, he's going for more. He wants more. Yoku's hacks are definitely on at the moment. He's going to be looking straight on that cam. He's probably realising that the deep... He's got it for it again! But Brown was on there to watch the run out. Well, that is a good trade-off. A lot of utility <clears throat> have been taken off the board already from Yoku. With his 11th kill of the game. Taking out the Zofia. Oh, Yoku's left the game. We, we cannot see a rehost here from <clears throat> from triad here but their carry is already gone hopefully someone else can step up and take the reins we are going to see the nomad chubs come out early on here from pluto it is um a one for a one for one situation we are going to see the visual run in what is what is Pluto doing? Three of them still on their drones as initiations been retaken by the visual. He's taken out the drone. They're trying to drone him out. He's probably using his visual scanner to be able to not be seen. He's been taken out. Mix does get a kill on the flanker. And initiation is still being held here from Triad. Quinn has left as well. I don't know why both of them have left. I think we're going for a rehost after this round. It's 2v1 Pluto Monster versus Kishev and Exim MK. He's going to be holding the angle onto. Yeah, he's going to try and take out the drone. A bit of miss aim here from Kishev. But we can forgive him. He, he is a silver one after all. We're going to see. Exim or Zim maybe holding the angle with the SMG 11 he's going to be throwing the air jabs out with 32 seconds to go Pluto Monster's got him Pluto Monster's got to make a play here swings out with the shotgun misses the shot swings out again another shot and we are going to probably see a rehost here I'm not going to leave until the other team leaves but Just not seeing nothing here from Pluto. They are 5 3 down. Lost both of their defense. Both of their attack rounds. No, we're going to see a 5v3 played out here. We're going to see the 5v3. We're not going to see a rehost. I'm going to ask Keshev about the rehost, but <sighs> oh, <laughs> that's why <laughs> we are going to see them have a five-three lead here on defense, but it's probably going to be a seven-five win here for. Pluto with them having to play out the game with three players. I'm going to quickly get a drink and leave you guys to watch the game because <clears throat> my voice is gone. So um, I'm going to quickly get a drink and hopefully Pluto have done better than I've seen. But if they lose to three, I'm literally just leaving because this is just embarrassing. But yeah, I'll leave you guys watching the hacks being brought out from... Um, Kissive and um see you guys. I'm gonna go for a drink.
I've just come back to shambles. Not three v four with a minute forty five left. That's better there from Monster. They have no sight present at the moment. If they know that, Pluto Monster can go for a plant. It is going to be a 3v1. Let's see if Keshev can do this. The aim is a bit shambles here. Not going to see him overpeak. Something that I would have probably done. Not going to lie. I would have tried and overpeaked. He's pre firing everything. Thinking that he's some sort of bolo here. We are going to see the pre-fire through the wall. We're going to see him reload. We're going to see him pre-fire. But the other man's pre-fire is way better. Well done there from Pluto Jamie. We're going to see it put 5-4. Well, Triad could have had this game if Yoku and... Um, That Quinners was still here. But he just wasn't to be. They only need one point to get a draw here. So, <clears throat> hopefully we go see the draw. Because um, I don't think um, Triad deserved to lose this match. But more importantly, I don't think Pluto deserved to win this match. But, we'll see. We'll see if it comes into play. Yep, they're going for a down to this hole. Probably free on site. It is pretty sad to me having to cast a 5 every fucking free, but... <clears throat> we take it how it is, boys. <coughs> Fuck me. Shit. not really looking forward to um watching these last couple of rounds we're just gonna see a 3v5 it's not exciting to watch and they're still going to be roam clearing even though the two roamers from last round are just not in play i'm just gonna circle around these players for a bit because i'm not very happy in having to um <coughs> casting a five versus three Uh, just not being um that organised, and it it is gonna it is gonna cost them. We are gonna see the IQ above getting yellow wall. They are gonna get yellow wall. We are gonna see <coughs> see them get yellow wall, and it's just gonna be an easy easy win. There's half HP off mystery from the... Both C4s have gone out there. Oh no, only one. One of them was a breach charge, but... 50 HP taken off mystery. There from the bandit. We are going to see... Um, Mute on 120 HP. Just below. We are going to see the Thermite... Take out... Yellow wall, but he's going to lag... Or that is just on my side, I'm pretty sure. Oh, and we do see Monster get absolutely folded by Millie. We're going to see the Ying come in. But no push behind the Ying. 
Not very smart from Mystery there. Another Ying coming in and another non-pushed Ying. Oh, he has gone down. He doesn't see the guy. What is Mystery doing? Not looking at a... At Pussy Corner. Brown gets the... Dip. I... To be honest, lads. I don't even want to see Pluto win. Just the stupid mistakes that they've been making have just not excited me. But <clears throat> they have got the plant down. Kishev the silver has only got below 20 HP here. And I I just can't be asked. I just can't be asked to um Yeah, oh he does get one kill. Not using the shotgun. Uh, yeah, they're both gonna be holding top floor presence. Yeah, and there's the top floor presence coming into play. It's now 5 all. Okay, to be honest, in my opinion, this, this game shouldn't even be going on right now. I should have left it for another day. Because if I was Pluto, I wouldn't be happy with this win. I know a winner is a win and all, but I would not be happy with this win. I see a bunk daycare hold. Pretty standard here. <clears throat> the Jaeger, the Bandit, the Legion. I'd just go for a rush tactic if I was Pluto. Get this match out of the way. Be like, I. We don't want to do this anymore. We just want to go. Fuck you guys over. And just get it over with. Now, let's see the uh, let's let's see the ranks of these kids while we um wait. Gold free, one point one. Decent. We got a one one point oh plat free with a one point oh KD. We got Keshiv, the guy I've been talking about, the silver one. Love to see lower ranks <coughs> in these kind of um competitive scenes in Rainbow Six getting their experience. I'm going to see Pluto Brown, 1.0 Plat 3. Pluto Jamie, 1.0 Gold 2. We're going to see Pluto Mystery, Gold 1, 1 1.2. We're going to see Marcel, the guy <coughs> who's probably the carry, but I haven't seen a lot of him in this game. And we're going to see Pluto Monster, the captain, the absolute dominant Blackbeard main, who has just not shown up today. If I was Pluto, I'd be very worried for the future of this league. They've struggled really big amounts. We are going to see a very strange spawn peak come out here from um, Exim. We, we, we're going to see no one on site. Oh no, we are going to see Kezia on site. But I think this is a very smart move being played here from, <coughs> from Triad. Bro, you're going to see hit points coming off the ash. The yeah, Jaeger just going to be trying to give that throne presence. And he's got all the way back down throne. He's taking a couple of hit markers off Marcel, putting him towards 50 HP. And we're just going to see him drop off. A very smart thing to do here. And um, they're all on the roof. They're still bloody droning in a 5v fucking 3. Like, I don't know what these men expect. That's going to happen to them. Yeah, they are playing spread out. It's up. You're thermiting and unreinforced wall. Shoot it out. Legion, what are you doing? Shoot it. It's um. I don't even want to cast. Like, this This is... I'm not even sure what... That, and, and Pluto Mystery gets killed. It's 4v2 now. The Doc is going to try. He gets the frag. He gets the frag onto Ash. They only need this round to get the draw. Doc is going to dock himself. 
A very mysterious wall bang there from the Jaeger. He's going to be laying down, watching the door. We have seen no push into sight from the Thermite. He is going to push out, get killed. They've just thrown this round. They could have had this very easily. Unless the Doc gets the planter right here. Oh, no. And a 6-5. But the, I don't... If you ask me, this, this has just been embarrassing. Yeah. Look, the doc's looking at him, misses every shot. Pluto's just like, I, I'm going to flick on to your head, mate. Yeah, yeah, you're just dumb. Just get out my face. And we and we do, we do see that. I'm just not very hopeful for the future of both of these teams. Trier don't have proper players who will stay and stick with them. And we see Pluto just struggling. None of these teams deserve the win. One because of disorganisation from Triad. And the second because Pluto are just not on their game today. We have seen some couple of nice shots and some couple of nice play plays come out. But um I'm not sure at the moment. I'm just hoping both teams can bounce back and try and compete for this league. Myself, I do play in this league. I play for Unknown GG. We lost 7-5 to um, C7 the other day in this exact same league. Very good game. Should go watch it. But um, I'm not sure what we're supposed to see here. If we're supposed to see improvements, if we're supposed to be just anything else from Pluto here. Okay, hopefully this ends quick. They are gone down back to throne. Just can't decide. I would have gone back to bunk if I was them. They played that pretty well. But again, just can't see anything going right for them here. We are going to see Keshev. Oh. We're going to see that spawn peak come out again from Exim. Yeah, we're getting a cover hit on Marcel again. As Pluto Mystery does go into the Ash with the Black Ice Pistol. The 5-7. Not normally a um, preferred pick for most um, Ash Jaeger main, Ash mains. If I was... They can't even reinforce... Why have they not reinforced every single wall? The Jaeger still has two reinforcements. He thinks Roman is more important than reinforcing sight. Oh, is he going to go reinforce sight? Yes, he is. Well done, Jaeger. Yeah, we are going to see him try and get yellow wall again. Hopefully Brown doesn't die early on. Oh, and we see the Ash just fold. He's going to try and play aggressive on Hatch. Yeah, not knowing that the guy's pushing him from a split. They, they just let him run in pussy corner. Just not trying to get the frags. Yeah, the pre-fire comes out. The kill comes out. He's going to go for a last pistol kill. It, Marshall's just not going to get it. Keshev trying to relieve pressure. And there is the game. Well done, Pluto, for winning a 5v3. That is not the kind of game I would love to be seeing here, but it is over. Well done, both teams. And um, that's the end of the stream.